The three ridings of Yorkshire are the ancient divisions of the county and the creation of the Norse period, from which Yorkshire itself arose. Yorkshire, as the largest county in the United Kingdom, is most conveniently divided, and the three ridings are the fundamental, geographical, and cultural divisions of the Shire. The three ridings surround the city of York, their boundaries meeting at the walls of the city. Thus, York within the walls, is the only part of Yorkshire outside any of the ridings. The three are, 1. The East Riding. The smallest and least hilly of the three, much of it in the plains, extending from the north bank of the Humber, and containing the seaport city of Kingston upon Hull. 2. The North Riding. Extending from the Pennines to the North Sea, the most rural, but still containing Middlesbrough on industrial Teesside. 3. The West Riding. The largest and most urbanized, as its southern parts contain the great industrial cities of Yorkshire, the largest being Leeds and Sheffield. Though in its north, it encompasses some of the finest of the Yorkshire Dales. Each riding is divided into wapentakes. The name, riding, is from the Old Norse riding or reing, meaning a thirding. The term, thriding, survived into the Middle Ages. The names, area, population, and principal towns of each riding are as follows. The whole county of Yorkshire has an area of 6,081 square miles, with a population totaling 5,218,838. The East Riding of Yorkshire has an area of 1,181 square miles, and a population totaling 629,126. Principal towns of the East Riding are Kingston-upon-Hull, Beverley, Bridlington, Driffield, Filey and Hornsey. The North Riding of Yorkshire has an area of 2,135 square miles, and a population totaling 707,684. Principal towns of the North Riding are Middlesbrough, Northallerton, Redcar, Scarborough and Whitby. The West Riding of Yorkshire has an area of 2,763 square miles, and a population totaling 3,873,365. Principal towns of the West Riding are Bradford, Leeds, Sheffield, Wakefield, Halifax, Harrogate and Ripon. It appears that each riding had a common law moot, or court, just as the Shire had its Shire moot. According to the 12th century compilation, known as the Leges Edwardi Confessoris, the riding was the third part of a county, Provincia. To it, causes were brought, which could not be determined in the Wapentake and the matter which could not be determined in the riding, was brought into the court of the Shire. There is abundant evidence, that riding courts were held after the Norman conquest. A charter which Henry I granted to the Church of St. Peter's, at York, mentions Wapentak Mott, Triding Mott and Shire's Mott, MOT designates a moot, or court of popular assembly, and exemptions from suit to the thriding or riding, may be noticed frequently in the charters of the Norman kings. The Yorkshire ridings maintain separate quarter sessions, from the Middle Ages to modernity, though a single sheriff served Yorkshire, until administrative zones subsumed the functions of traditional areas. The Yorkshire ridings were administered separately until administrative changes in 1974. Winifred Holtby's 1936 novel, South Riding, and its adaptations, were set in a fictional fourth riding, based on the West Riding. The title of the novel trilogy, Red Riding, by David Peace, set in Yorkshire, is a play on the word. An additional division found in Yorkshire, is the Ainsty of York. This is not a fourth riding but a wapentake of the West Riding, though sometimes found mapped attached to the East Riding. It extends south, from the walls of York. It was a medieval liberty, granted to the corporation of the city of York, in which the corporation exercised jurisdiction, to provide an additional income for the city. Yorkshire is unique as a county, in being divided into three ridings. However, one other county, Lincolnshire, is anciently divided into three parts, Lindsay, Holland, and Castephen. Lindsay is itself, 
divided into three ridings, the North Riding, South Riding, and West Riding. Thus, there is indeed a South Riding, but not in Yorkshire. In the 19th century, Parliament effected a division of two of the larger Irish counties, those of Cork and Tipperary. Each was set into two divisions, which were called ridings, a thing hard to justify etymologically, as riding means a third.